90 seconds on the path of grace. Another interesting thing that the book of Revelation talks about is an event that will happen in Jerusalem where two guys are actually killed and left on the street and it says the whole world watches. Now that used to be an impossibility. How could people around the globe have the opportunity to watch in real time something happening in Jerusalem? There's no way. Hold on, wait a minute. Anyone that's been born in the last 20 years can't remember life without being able to watch something real time around the globe. I remember when the war in Iraq started, we were watching war in real time and some of the footage was being sent over people's cell phones. It was amazing. So again, what does all this mean for us practically? Well, I think it means that the things Paul talked about regarding Christ and believers today, the body of Christ being caught up or snatched away, could be happening very, very soon. It could be just over the horizon. Now, some people would think I'm nuts for thinking that that is a literal event. Well, I believe it is a literal event because when Paul talks about it in 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, he is speaking words of comfort to people who are literally grieving over people who have literally died. They're people who literally need hope. They literally need comfort. And so Paul is talking about a literal event to bring them comfort. He's not talking about something figurative. To hear more, visit jamesflanders.com.